hello guys assalamu alaikum welcome back to another video in this video i'm gonna show you how can install android studio and how to create any project there and how to run this project in your virtual android phone okay so first of all you need to open your favorite browser and search for android studio and as you can see you need to visit the first link which is appear here which is from developer.android.com just click on it and once you click on it it will open this kind of web page and here you can see the download option here is the download android studio giraffe at the time making this video android studio giraffe is the latest one so just click on it so once you click on it it will appear the terms and condition of android studio you need to scroll down and click here this checkbox and click the download android studio giraffe okay and as you can see our download is started so once our download is complete here is our android studio exe file which we are download and for install it you need to double click on it once you click on it it will appear the installation wizard you just need to click here next option and here is the choose component you need to set here by default and click on next then it will show you the configuration settings that means where our android studio will be installed I just set it as by default and choose here next. Then it will show you the choose start menu folder. I just set it as by default and choose here install. And our installation is started. And our installation is complete. Just click on next and click on finish. After that, it will show you this warning for import Android Studio settings. I just choose here do not import settings and click on ok after that it will appears this message for help to improve the android studio i just choose here the don't send if you want you can send the uses statistics to google ok then it will show you the welcome message you just choose here next option and choose here your installation type i just choose here custom and click on the next then it will offer you to choose your theme if you want you can use the light theme or the dracula theme i choose here dracula and click on the next then it will show you the sdk component setup i just set it as by default and choose here next then it will show you the emulator settings here you need to allocate the ram size which is need to be used to run the virtual android phone okay so here they recommend to use 4 gb if you want you can increase it but i want to stay with 4 gb and choose here next then again you need to choose here next and also choose here next so then it will show you the license agreement here you need to accept three license agreement first one is android sdk license second one is android sdk preview license and last one is intel android extra license okay make sure that all of the license is accepted and then click on finish okay and it will automatically start downloading components okay So as you can see our installation is complete just click on the finish and then it will open the android studio welcome page okay so for create here any project just click on the new project and choose here empty activity and click on next so here you can change the android application name package name save location minimum sdk okay so i just change the name my android application and here is the save location 
where our project will be saved and here is the minimum SDK which by default set here Android 7.0 and at the below you can see your app will be run on the approximately 95.4% of device that means all of the Android phone your application will be run okay then choose here finish and after that you need to again click on the finish so this is the interface of android studio okay and here is the information what is new in this giraffe version if you want you can read this so now we need to wait here a little bit for fully set up our android studio here you can see the it's downloading some of packages to run the android application okay so as you can see our android studio setup is fully complete now you can see all of the file of this android studio project here is the main activity file by default the main activity is showing us the hello android message if we run this project you can see this message okay so for run this project here is your virtual android phone which is by default it set pixel 3a and if you want you can change the device here to select the multiple device okay but i set it as by default and click on the run option and as you can see the processing is started and as you can see here is our virtual pixel 3a android phone and as you can see here is the output of this project which is hello android okay so i hopefully guys you properly understand how to install the android studio in your windows operating system and how to create here any project and how to run it in this virtual android phone okay if you enjoy this video don't forget to like comment and share and if you like this type of video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also press the bell icon and I will see you guys in this next one inshallah. Thank you so much.